Hello and welcome everybody to the 2022 Poker Chip Buying Guide. A little different from last year as I think it's inflation. Either way, some of these chips, their prices have increased a little bit. So we're going to start with, look at these, look at this flashing. Can you see this? It looks like they were just molded on like a tree or something. These are little mini poker chips. They're available on Amazon. You can flick them like this into your palm right here. It's pretty cool. Whoa. Oh, that totally hit the camera. Oh, let's grab another one. Uh, to represent some entry level chips here, you can get these little mini chip tokens. These are great for beginners or somebody who just needs some little tokens. Doesn't matter what you're using these for, playing Pokemon or whatever. You can write, like you can always write denominations. If somebody's complaining, I don't know what denomination, just give them a marker and say, here, label all of them. And then they'll know. So incredibly, good deals on these uh, around $15 for 400 500 that sort of thing. Uh, price and availability always subject to change in everything that you see in front of the camera. Everything you see in front of the camera, I purchased with my own money. So little mini poker chips, tokens, whatever you want to call them. It's a good entry point. Another good entry point are these dice chips. These used to be about $20 for 300 Now they're, what, $28, $30 for 300, I've seen like 36, 39 in some cases. Now they're sold as clay chips. Now just be aware that clay is a very common additive to plastic and how much clay is actually in here, no idea. But it is a metal slug ABS chip and they're not very impressive. They're just chips. No denominations, no recess for a label, just chips. And when we look at some other chips like that. We have these bicycle chips. These are not metal slugged, so there's no metal in here. It's just a plastic chip, kind of a heavier polymer. Again, these have gone up in price a little bit. I think it's more than $10 for 100 of these now, which isn't terrible, but, you know, kind of pricey for what they are, just a, you know, a plastic chip. And, you know, they're, like I said, they come in different colors. I think the ones I've seen are like green, blue, and red. When... We take a step up even a little bit further, we move into chips with denominations. Same thing, kind of metal slug ABS chips, but we get labels. So for example, here's one I purchased from Apache Poker Chips. And these things are a hot item. These are very popular in the ABS chip world. They're pretty affordable. They're around, I wanna say they're around 20 cents a chip. You'll see the graphic, it'll show you the price. Again, prices and availability subject to change. James Bond theme here, lovely kind of a crown mold around here, Casino Royale label, just a really solid, good looking chip, smooth edges all the way around. Some less expensive chips used to have flashing, like for example, here's some old Casino Las Vegas, Nevada chips. These used to have flashing, I'm not sure if they still do, it's been years since I purchased some of these, but just around the edges right here, you can feel kind of a sharp edge where it feels like the mold was stuck together and kind of a sharp edge, not a huge deal. You can, you know, polish that off, but take it for what it's worth. These have also gone up a lot. These used to be 12 cents a chip. Now I think they're 24 cents a chip. Again, you'll see the price in 2022. And again, this is all probably going to change if inflation keeps going the direction that it's going. Casino Royale chips, absolutely lovely. Las Vegas. Another one of my favorites are these Outlaw chips. Now, something I want to mention while I'm talking about the outlaw, I'm just going to talk about each segment briefly and just give you a few examples. There is a huge selection of ABS chips and ultimately it comes down to what you like the look of. And here's a great example. So if you like to see the denomination as like the primary thing that's bold and you can easily see it large centered, then you're going to want to choose something like that as opposed to like these Las Vegas chips with a small denomination or these which kind of blend in like you can see the 25 down here kind of blending in with this bandana handkerchief neckerchief kind of thing so you know your opinion is more important than my opinion but these are one of my favorite ABS chips again they're I want to say they're around 20 cents a chip is it 22 cents a chip 18 cents a chip prices can vary a little bit so very lovely chip. I love the mold. It has kind of a unique mold here. It has a lovely label right here. It's a sticker label, but they're permanent. They use kind of a permanent adhesive, and so I haven't had a problem with these coming off. But this unique mold, very happy with that, as opposed to kind of a more generic no mold style chip. 
Mold refers to the textured stamp. You can see there's some texture around here and there's the text stamped into the chip. So I love, I love that mold. Now, again, for a little bit more, I think these are 45 cents a chip. These are also very popular. These are China clays. This is a heavy plastic, unlike the ABS metal slug chips. There's no metal slug in here. It's just a heavy polymer, similar to the bicycle chip, but they have kind of more of a casino chip feel to them. And they and that comes with some VOC smell, volatile organic compound. The best way to describe it for me is like PVC pipe or like fresh carpeting kind of smells plasticky sometimes. These can have that smell. So if you're sensitive to smell, be advised, you might wanna buy a sample set of these, especially before you purchase a whole bunch of them. I know I've, in my reviews, I've heard complaints about people really not liking the smell. So something to consider, but I love the feel of these chips. Again, we have a label here. These are replicas of an actual casino chip, but remember these are China clay. So you can pursue that if you wish and look in the description as to where I would recommend buying these, where I purchased these. I guess there are lots of good places to purchase these, but where I purchased these chips. And you will also see my Amazon shop where you can purchase some of these. I am an Amazon associate. I make proceeds from qualifying purchases. And if we move up, so these are roughly 45 cents a chip. So Dunes, lovely. There are other, you know, China clays available. And the next segment up is kind of a different breed altogether, and that are these ceramic chips. Both of these I paid for with my own money, and both of these come from BR Pro Poker, which has a lovely selection, but they're not the only game in town. BBO Poker Tables, and there are various other places you can go to get some really amazing ceramics. Tiki Kings, one of my favorites, one of my family favorites. Everybody loves these chips. They are a hard plastic, and they might make it mix in some sort of ceramic powder into the mix, but the feel is very hard plastic. They don't have the sound or the brittle nature of china. Like you think of bone china in ceramic dishes, these don't feel like that. They feel more, more plasticky. And again, all of these have different sounds, ABS plastic being pretty soft, china clays being pretty soft, and ceramics by far being the hardest material that we see. So Tiki Kings, one of my favorite, and these are running around 75 cents a chip. And depending on how many you buy, that price can change a little bit. Dia de los Muertos, lovely chip. This is one, this is a really festive chip. This is one of my favorites, Dia de los Muertos, very popular ceramic chip, something to definitely consider. And then we move into, after you push past ceramics, you really push into premium chips like Poker Chips Online, Classic Poker Chips, formerly ASM. And these are the last casino grade chips that are available to consumers. You can get custom chips if you want, or you, like these Atlantic Club, you can get stock inlay chips. So this is an actual inlay, meaning while they're making the chip, while the chip is hot, they stamp this inlay into the chip. It's part of the chip. You can't just scrape it off. You actually need to pry. It's like destroying the chip. You actually pry this out and there's a hole there and it just looks terrible. So I love inlays, very much a casino quality chip. Now, there are some different stock chips available. I'll try to get a picture in from their website. And something important to understand about these premium chips, they can be expensive. You're talking more than $2 a chip and there can be, depending on demand, there can be a long wait for an order. So some chips, you know, are just mass produced and there are, you know, tens of thousands of them readily available. You can just go on Amazon or wherever and just purchase a whole bunch of them, dice chips in particular. But casino grade chips, you might have to wait. Uh, and if you put in custom orders, I know people that wait months to get their orders. So be advised, you might, might want to contact Classic Poker Chips before you make an order and make sure that you can get what you need when you need it. If you're looking to order premium chips, yes, they are expensive, and yes, there can be a wait. That doesn't, there won't necessarily be, but there can be, especially if demand is really high, really high-end premium chips. Now, to make this really short, and I'm just gonna talk briefly about it, there are some other chips which you can purchase. 
which are no longer available, and I don't consider them stock chips, but just I want you to be aware that there are some chips, like for example, these Paulson Classics, made by Paulson, who makes casino chips, no longer offer consumer grade chips. You can find some of these on the open market, secondhand market, eBay. And depending, you know, with inflation, these have gotten pretty pricey, so probably not a viable option for a lot of people. And you can also get used casino chips. I know I saw some at the making of this video early January 2022 at Apache Poker Chips. They had some really interesting used casino chip sets. Obviously, they're casino used, so they're going to be pretty heavily worn. But for buying some casino grade chips, those look like a pretty good value. Again, the availability on these is very subject to change. They can sell out in one day and take that for what it's worth. So those are some options to explore. And again, this is very much an introductory guide for everybody out there looking for a set of poker chips. You can see there's a huge range. If you just want some something to hold you over for a little bit, little tokens can do the job or something inexpensive. And once you dive into ceramics, you have chips that are gonna last you a very long time. Premium chips, again, a very long time. And if you're interested in talking about custom ceramics, I have a video about that. I made my custom ceramic set here. You can go look that video up on my channel. If you want to support this channel, you can join us on Patreon. I post an update several times a month, just give you kind of a behind the scenes, what's going on with several of my channels. And it's just general support. Thank you so much to my patrons. If you enjoy this content, please subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.